Who is Jeremy Lucas? Well, he was the England fly fishing team manager. He was a member of the England fly fishing team back in the day at its heyday. And he was like one of the first people to really bring light line, soft rod fly fishing to the UK, both in rivers and in still waters. Being a micro thin fly line is 20% thinner than a regular fly line. Let me show you what it does. There we go. That was a humongous cast for a two weight in a flat calm. And so the whole system came together. The line, the rod, the line slick, the tippet. You get multiple shots at rising fish simply because the line lands so delicately on the water. It's the perfect dry fly line for rods over nine feet long, but don't just use it for dry fly. It's an excellent Czech nymphing line, Euro nymphing. Just regular nymphing. I use it for still waters. This is the line for ultimate presentation with rods that are over nine feet long. Having the overhang marker tells me exactly when I can release the line into the shot. Having the overhang marker closer to my hand when I make the forward casts means I can make shorter casts. Releasing the line when the overhang marker is in the rod rings means that sort of medium range cast. And when the overhang marker is just outside of the rod tip and I release that forward cast, the distances are extreme. At 33 feet long, this head length is designed for beginners, intermediates, and expert casters because it sits right in that range where fish are normally caught. You don't have to cast far. There you go. On a two way. Bang. Okay. The overhang marker tells me exactly when the optimal time is to release the forward cast. I can slip that overhang marker into the rod rings as I'm doing now and know that that rod is loaded perfectly. If I pull that overhang marker and let it fall to the floor, I can make short casts in more sniper style fishing. You see how gently that landed. All my lines are spay tapers. It means that the weight is towards the rear of the line. It means I have directional stability. It means I can control where it's going. If the weight was distributed towards the fly end, I wouldn't be able to control it. Being closer to the rod tip means I can control the line better. It's as simple as that, simple physics. I can make long roll casts with this line. Roll casts are easy. This is the line for ultimate presentation with rods that are over nine feet long. 